Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to the plane. <laughs> we're not in Maui yet. We're not in Hawaii, but we're get, we're gonna be there very soon, you guys. Look at all this leg room too. Yeah, huh? Put your legs up like this. Put your legs. I have to. <laughs> I, have to sl I have to slide down my seat to reach this, and and Austin just can. He's just casual. Super casual over here. He, he's business casual today, so um, we got a six hour flight ahead of us, so let's do it. I feel like I'm wearing <laughs> I feel like I'm wearing a dress right now. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> this is weird. It's getting weird. <laughs> this is like it's just I just want to remind you, uh, we are 24 years old, so. Oh, we'll get it. We'll get it, all right. Man, oh, dude, this is nice. I'm about to take off my shirt, too. Six. For what? Seven hours. 24 plus seven is 31. Okay, good math there. I We're here. Hour. We're on the streets of Maui, Hawaii, uh, specifically Wala. I have to look this up. The city? Whatever specifically this place is. Wailuku. Wailuku. And I shouldn't say Hawaii, I should say Hawaii, because that's how they say it. Hawaii. 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 It's Hawaii. Hawaii. We are headed to a grocery store right now because we need water, and I personally need some food. Austin can't have food because he's fasting. Oh boy. Island life. Oh, thank you. Wow. Cars are actually nice and they let you cross, believe it or not, around here. Cars are actually friendly. Oh, the grass feels weird, you guys. Look at this. The grass around here feels very um, soft and uh, floofy. It feels floofy. Look at this. Buildings with what no, a cloud. The mountain. Buildings and clouds with a mountain. Alright guys, it's a bit of a struggle carrying these groceries back, but that's okay. Handleless paper bags. We're fine. I'm fine. I got four bottles of water and I got a couple snacks. Austin got water. And that's it. Are you telling them I'm fasting? Because he's fasting. Yeah. Okay. They know. Yeah guys, I'm doing a five day fast. I'm already struggling. I'm 30 hours in. He, he thought he was too thick, so he decided to go on a fast. He really has to cut down on the, sure. cut down on the calories. Sticky? It's hot in here. Okay. It's really sticky. Guys, Austin's already complaining about the Airbnb. It was cheap, so when you're balling on a budget, you gotta sacrifice comfort for money or whatever it is. So, let me give you guys a tour of the Airbnb really quickly. Um, we have a fridge. We have a bed, and there's another bed underneath here. Um, we have an end table right over there. Um, we have Austin. He just, he's stuck in here, can't leave. Big screen TV, couple chairs. Oh, hey, look, we can dine. There's a table. We get look, a couple fans. We got a table here. If we pull it out, we can dine. Oh, my water. We can eat. Austin can't eat, though. He's a fasty boy on his fast. This is awful. Uh, we got a microwave here, and we got a um, record player? I don't know. Are you serious? We got a closet. We got a uh, sink. Let's put on the lights here. We got a toilet, shower. Oh my gosh. We have a little oven thing, like a, I don't even know what this is, but we got dishes as well. Okay. Towels. Let's look in the toilet. Guys, a sneak peek into a Hawaiian toilet. A Hawaiian toilet. Huh? Get a load of that, guys. All right, that's the, and that is the place that we're staying in. And it, it is also probably like 85 degrees in here. But you know what? We live in Arizona. It's like 110 degrees there, so we're used to it. Guys, apparently this street, our Uber driver, we Ubered here, apparently, this street right here used to be popping before COVID, but now there's not a lot of people, not a lot of tourists and stuff. 
There's a movie theater right here too. We were told right there. They're not running movies or anything though right now, unfortunately. But in the video it says the second day is actually the worst day. You have like a headache. Yeah. Seven cramps and pains. Whoa, we got some mechanics. What are they working on? Look at that. Look at those vehicles. Listen, you guys, I don't know much about cars, but that's an old car. Look it up, Google. What car is that, you guys? Tell me, educate me, because I don't know anything about... Scared me a little bit, too. <laughs> the bus... I tell you what, me and Austin, when we go to places, we're really good at walking down roads that are very... Uh, that have sidewalks very close to the cars. We love to really... We love having cars scrape right by us. We can almost feel the side view mirror nick our ear. You know, that's what we like. Bok, 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 bok. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Oh, weird. Oh, yeah. Right there, Guys, like it's hold on, I'm gonna back. step, I'm gonna step through here. Guys, look. Look at this view. Huh? How about this, guys? That's so weird. This is very weird. Look is at that. Movie Dude, this, no, 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 this is, uh, you mean Inception? You mean Inception? No, interstellar. Where it goes up. The, but you know what I'm saying, the dream where the, the, oh, yeah. it's like the same kind of deal, yeah. Interstellar though, where like, they have to very- Yes, Interstellar, yes, yes. It looks like that, because it's going Yes. It's so oh, that's so strange. It literally looks like it's curving up. Oh my gosh, okay, guys, this, so what you see on camera does not do it justice, though. This literally looks like it's curving, like, it's flat land, but it's curving upwards. That's the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. It's it's flat land, it's curving upwards. Some would describe it as a hill, but like if you see it in person, it looks really strange with the clouds over and everything. Wailuku? So usually when people come to Maui, oh, uh oh. Fun, fun police. police here, it's fun police, even though it's an ambulance. Oh, what's it up on? He's remix. Yeah. Um Usually when people come to Maui, I mean, I, I don't know what, what's commonplace for tourists, but I'm assuming that most of them would go to like the coast, to like a resort or something. I don't know how many uh, tourists stay in uh, the actual like city, which is Waluku? Yeah, Waluku or something like that. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm not good. I'm not smart. We don't know, I mean, how many tourists are staying in the city versus going out into a resort, but we're staying in the heart of the city. If you guys are wondering where we're going to right now, we are headed to the beach. Day one, it's beach day. Woo! Guys, I'm sorry if the vlog gets screwed up by the wind, but the wind is a little pesky here. Wow. Looks like a tornado is coming. But it's not. Are you guys ready for the big reveal? Here we go, guys. Are you kidding me? Look at this. Look at that. Dude, look at the waves. Holy crap. Let's walk to the edge of the water and let's see if we can see some turtles or some sharks hopefully you guys can hear me because the uh, wind is a little bit mental right now oh my gosh i almost just fell all right hey, let's take a look here oh good this is gonna be good for laying guys this is good for laying out on your towel here it's perfect this is the kind of beach that she want to take a towel and just lay out right here Right across the rocks here. Ouch. What's crazy is if I, oh my gosh. If I fell in there, if I fell in this water, I would probably die. I would probably die if I fell in this water right here. Austin, go smile, smile, go. Get in front and smile of the mountains. Yeah, there you go. Right there, good. Smile. Woo! Let's 
Let me show you guys something really quickly. This is good welcoming. Good welcoming party here. All right. Nothing like an empty beer bottle on a Hawaiian beach. Aloha. Look across here too, guys. Look at that. Unbelievable. There they go. Wow. Is that called rowing? Rowing, guys. Look at this. We got some rowers here. I don't know if you guys can see it or not over in the distance here. There's a little rainbow over in the distance. We've got a, what appears to be a grave site. How the heck are you supposed to drive that? How, who's driving that vehicle? I don't even think that's legal. Is that legal to have that kind of a low rider? Low rider, huh? Is that even legal, you guys? I mean, and plus, why would you drive it like that? Any kind of curb, it's you're gonna get screwed. I know it's all about the style, but it's dangerous. It's a, it's a liability. Also, I'm noticing a lot of chickens around here. A lot of loose chickens. And a lot of uh, truck, like truck shops here, like a lot of garages and stuff. Like, what is this? What is this? I don't. I does not know. It's also getting dark, so you know what they say in Hawaii: when the lights go out, the wolves come out. There are no wolves here, though, so we're safe. It's okay. I've also noticed with the way that I'm dressed, with the way that I'm dressed right now, I look like a daggum Barbie doll right now. I gotta change. I don't know why I'm all pinked out in Hawaii. Hawaii. I look like a friggin' Barbie doll. Look at this shot. Through the concrete, the hills survive. Mountains, volcanoes whatever you want to call them. How safe is this sidewalk? I don't think it's that safe, guys. We're pretty close to the road. All right, guys, well, we are going to be sitting, I'm sorry, I'm eating right now, I apologize. Austin's in the bathroom, so this is my only time to eat when he's not around. Otherwise, he starts complaining to me about how he can't eat food. And how he's fasting and everything. Even though he brought this pain on himself, he complains to me. He complains to me. When you fast, I'm going to eat right in front of you like what you did to me. And you're going to be worse. But the thing, guys, the thing about me is, though, I'm mentally tough. Austin, he cried. He was crying earlier. I, didn't, I couldn't show it on camera. He had tears in his eyes. He was crying. When I was buying this food, he was crying. But we walked around a bit. Now it's getting dark out, so me and Austin are gonna lay down the beds here. We're gonna lay and watch, uh, watch SpongeBob. Two 24-year-old men, we're gonna watch SpongeBob. It's a new tradition we've created on our travels to watch Spongebob, so. Local time is 8.12 for us, right? For us right now, it is 11.12 technically in Phoenix, so it is about bedtime. Me and Austin have been laying watching Spongebob for the past hour and a half. Also, Austin is finding hairs in his bed, which is good. That's good. Safe. This makes you think of Paris. <laughs> You're shining <laughs> a flashlight in someone's face in the GoPro. But yeah, there's hair, um, like black hair like this long. Definitely uh, not me <laughs> or Clayton. And I found like four of them on my pillow, so. So Austin is very comfortable 
He's getting a little too comfortable over there, you guys. It's definitely not hot in here. It definitely does not feel like Thailand with no AC right now either. It's definitely <laughs> super cold. <laughs> we, we have a permanent glaze of sweat over us, and it's going to be like that the whole time. We're both like shining. <laughs> both sh glistening at, at night. There's no uh, sunshine. We just have p a permanent stain on ourselves of sweat. So... Um, we're going to bed, you guys. Thank you very much for watching. We have there's more to come. Okay, there's a lot more to come. POV. This is me interviewing you on the streets of Paris, you guys, three weeks ago. Here we go. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. Dude, this is creepy. Wow. Look at my eyes.